well uh, as you are aware there was a out outer perimeter fence uh, was a big problem i don't think we can finish that uh, before this game we are planning to finish uh, ha complete the three one days and look for uh, for the fourth odi against india as well so at the moment uh, originally we set aside a budget of 20 million rupees to refurbish but i think we will be spending about 8 to 10 million rupees because the mainly we are looking at the two dressing rooms umpires match referees area we have a severe problem uh, with regard to the grandstand uh, engineers have asked us not to use it due to uh, non completion of the, the glass work there is a danger that glasses are coming out already four uh, main glasses have come out so therefore we are we are securing certain areas uh, for public not to go uh, until we complete our uh, major repair so for the purpose of this tournament you know, we feel uh, this is adequate uh, for the ground area to sort of uh, play a good uh, tournament or, um, or the series but if the wickets are fantastic wickets are absolutely no problem side practice fa facilities everything is okay but then um, because of uh, uh, maintenance uh, you know it's central air condition uh, uh, plant which is running it costs us about approximately a, a million rupees a month to run the uh, electricity so it is not designed for a smaller game you have to run the main air condition if you are to play any game even if it is a club game so there is a design there is a uh, issue that we can't cope with so we are slowly looking into all that so this is a Uh, to know and we think it's good for us to if we are ever to go back this is the best time to start if this can be a successful story they will we are looking at the fourth odi against india to play there uh, do you have any numbers with regard to costs that have on you taken costs at the moment and going off going forward well i think uh, uh, i don't know i think uh, engineers are looking at uh, taking the glasses off from the uh, grandstand because it's not properly handed over to the, uh, the 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 contractors have not handed that over to the engineers or or the consultants the consultants have not handed that whole venue back to uh, technically the engineers have not handed it over to the client which is ports authority ports authority has not handed it over to sri lanka cricket so there is no completion of the project to hand over. so there are a lot of lapses in the construction work so all will see it one day when you go there so we have to manage this it's it's asset already invested for and we want to make some use of it <coughs>